Hey friends, I'm Pastor Joe. Today is Tuesday and I have your word for the day. Did you know that there's not one request you could make to God that would anger him? You could pray for anything you want. You could ask God for the moon. Will he give you the moon? Well, I think he's already using it. When God had determined that he was going to destroy the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah, Abraham pressed God to change his mind. He said, God, if there are 45 righteous men, will you spare the whole city? And God said, sure. Abraham said, what about 30 righteous? Will you spare the whole city if we can find 30 righteous people? And God said, sure, I'll spare the whole city. Abram kept pressing God and finally got down to 10. Lord, will you spare it if we can find 10 people who are righteous? Will you spare the rest of the thousands of people who live there if we can find 10 righteous people? And God said, you bet. God said, yes. Abram asked for more. God said, yes. Abram asked for more. I know sometimes... We can feel like we wear down God and burden him with our requests. But the fact is, we can't. Even if we asked wrong, even if our motives are wrong, God is never burdened by our prayer lives. In fact, God prefers our prayer lives to be fervent and persistent. So let me ask you, do you persist in your prayers or are you a one and done type of prayer? On one hand, I believe in faith that I've received what I ask for, and so I pray once, but on the other hand, we're also taught to be persistent in our prayers as well. So pray like Abraham. Be persistent. Be determined. You're not going to hurt God's feelings one bit. And remember this promise. God is able to abundantly and exceedingly do far more than we could ever think to ask of him. So be respectful and persistent in your prayers because he loves you. If today's word for the day has blessed you, like it, share it on social media, or leave a comment. God bless.